Okay, this is Temple OS 5-Minute Random Code Walkthrough, episode number 5. Here we go, Alt-B. Where are we? We are in the document editor code. When we, uh, okay. So what we're, uh, what we're dealing with here is uh, when you have a um, document in the form of um, a circular linked list of uh, entries. Um, so a document, uh, let's go ahead and just show what a document um, I'm going to go, I'm going to read a document and uh, doc equals doc read. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and uh, let's save the uh, the command line buffer, control A, control S, and then we do a directory. It saves it in, in your home directory. Now there's a document called temp. And it's the uh, saved image of the uh, of the uh, command line. So we're going to read um, what was it? Temp.txt. Temp.txt. Then we say we have doc entry star doc e equals doc dummy dot next. Okay, so, uh, well, doc, we're going to go in a circle, not equal to doc. There's a circular Q, and the first, um, the, um, the doc, doc is the uh, head of the Q. If we look at the format of a doc, doc entry base, oh, it's called root. Okay, so root next. I call it a root. I don't like head. <laughs> I don't know. So I, I use so uh, let's see percent let's say percent D Okay, so the uh, Command type is uh, okay. Let's see if this works. Okay, so we got a bunch of zeros, fourteens. I think fourteen is. Uh, let's do uh, percent Z. Percent Z. If we check percent Z. Um, in the print codes format strings percent Z is uh, um, define list um, pass sub entry first then define name so the sub entry is that and then uh, st doc entry I think st doc commands okay so uh, this should, so text, so there's the uh, commands. Okay, so now we, we have a general idea. Let's, uh, so it starts out, there's some uh, carriage return text, prompt, link. Let's go ahead and, uh, if it's a tag, um, Technically, we can. So if, if it's a tag, if uh, doc e flags, you'll notice we're doing this same operation. Um, oh, doc e d e flags and docs e e f if tag percent s comma doc 
Taki tag. Let's see what that does. Okay, so um, we're printing the tags, and the document we got was the command line. And let's see, so you can see text just for uh, let's. Okay, so there you can see what what the um, document entries are. Text, carriage return. So let's let's look at the document. So here's the document. All these entries. This this is the what we just looked at. So okay, now we know what we're looking at. So um, if sometimes we want to copy to the clipboard or something like that. And so what we do is we uh, we take an entry and uh, an entry has uh, there's two types of entries entries that are that are just the base and then extended entries. What I did is uh, I don't normally use all these extended fields. I just have stubby. Uh, there's there's entries that are stubby. Oh, I know what I can do. Watch this. Uh, Draw T. If it's a, uh, if it's a uh, percent X, if it's a text entry, then it's stubby. M size returns the size of a mallocated node. Okay, so uh, the text entries are 58 bytes. The the uh, everything else is D0, which is, uh, oh, I don't know, 140, 156, no, I don't know what it is, or 200 and, well, we can see what it is. It's uh, 208. So um, the text entries are 58, carriage returns 58, everything else is uh, D0. Now with that, the reason for that is... Uh, the text entries don't need all this crap, so we save a little bit of room by not by text and character turn do not have full entries. They just have stubby entries. So um, what we have to do is for all those fields are allocated a string in a malloc, and uh, so uh, if it has an auxiliary string, if it has a define, if it has an HTML, then these all have to uh, we out we allocate an identical chunk so that means we allocate it the same size and then we fill it in and uh, now binary uh, okay bin is for sprites those are a little more complicated there's a uh, there's a number for each binary entry that's the curve bin num and uh, um, there's a, a separate link, a separate queue, a circular queue of uh, binary nodes. These are uh, these go in a queue next last circular link list, and uh, they uh, they include uh, some stuff. Anyway, use count. They have a count for how many times they're used, and if it is uh, not used, it gets uh, deleted. Um, so uh, when you copy on the clipboard, that that calls this copy entry, and that makes an, a new binary entry, and it sticks it in the. Uh, I think this is the destination document. Um, anyway, uh, so the the binaries are a separate queue from the the text. Um, so if we're looking the doc. The document uh, structure. The document structure has a uh, a queue for uh, bin entries, and uh, so that so if it has a binary entry, it makes another entry in the queue. Long story short. Okay.